ASMR beard. How's it going, man? It's so good to see you back again. You're probably like my favourite regular. It's only been like two weeks anyway. But you know, like with a with a hairstyle like that, if you don't keep on top of it, it just kind of it goes pretty quick. So you've done the right thing. You just want a normal kind of thing again? Just keep it. Keep it simple. How you always have it. It's kind of becoming your like trademark, right? Cool. Right. If you want a normal, you know what to expect. And you know you're like one of my favourite customers as well. It's not just because you come so often. It's not just because you tip either. No, you're a good guy. Okay, let me just brush that out. Been up too much. Yeah. You don't have to do much to to be happy. I like having quiet time. I mean, I think it's kind of overrated. People thinking you got to do things all the time to be happy. I mean, you know, people's Instagrams are fake, right? People don't post when they're just sitting at home. People don't post when they're just having like ramen or a pot noodle for dinner. People only post the, the expensive meals out and the champagne. Good just to enjoy life for what it is, you know. That's what floats your boat, that's all good, but it's important as well to like find joy and find happiness in simple things. And if you do have something nice, you don't have to show everyone, you can just enjoy it for yourself. Your hair kind of looks cool, slick back. And that's not what you're going for, but. That looks cool. Right. Okay, you ready? You know, we're going to get to your beard in a minute, but that's looking strong as well. That's come on quick. I always knew, like when it came through, it looked good. No, yeah, that's cool. Good genetics. 
go put me out of the job, okay? human hair. Okay, that's looking cool. What do you think? Yeah? Okay. So, I think what we're going to do right now, we should get that last little bit. Okay, cool. So, we're going to move on to the beard. I know that's something you like, right? the beard you want to keep a little bit of the length just kind of tidy up the neck tidy up the cheeks that sort of thing and that's what I tend to do it's quicker to get ready in the morning right who doesn't want that okay so you know I'm all about convenience keep this all as, as tidy as possible We're dealing with blades, right? Okay, go. Cool. Let's get you all fined up. a gel rather than a phone. Just a little more sensitive and I think a lot of guys think they've got to use like the most masculine stuff but gel just feels better for me. And I think you've got a little bit of sensitive skin slightly like, like me, you know, so that's all good. There's nothing wrong with being a little bit sensitive in any way, you know, so needs to make contact with the skin and not just the hairs because it's kind of a lubricant for the skin rather than the hair learn something new every day huh if I just give it a little patch it helps the hairs to stand up a little
is all we need. Get a nice clean shave. And he smells good too, right? That's looking cool. Okay, I think I'm just about there. That's Take these off, be real careful. I was having a little trouble there, huh? Okay. So I'm just gonna go for your cheeks, okay? nice kind of patting it onto your face that that gel kind of stippling it on it's really kind of helped to bring the hairs a little more upright it's just a little trick of the trade you know Dextrous, so both sides will look exactly the same. It's one of the hardest things when you're cutting your own beard. That's why I like going to the barbers as well, because like you think you've got it the same on each side, but it's not normally the same on each side. Okay, it's just do your neck. He kind of keep his neck sort of in trim anyway, right? That's looking tidy. You saved me a little bit of work, huh? Okay. That's cool. You just check the cheeks. Okay. That's looking good. I'm just going to give you a quick rub down. I just want to make sure we've got some of that gel off, okay? Want to be leaving the hair looking your best and not kind of looking like yeah, you just got out of the shower. Just being gentle, you know, you've got to look after your skin. You should never just kind of rub your skin after you've uh, after you shaved. Be real gentle. That's kind of where a lot of shaving rash and ingrowing hairs will come from when you rough with your skin after the after the shave and not drawing. Okay, that's good. Right. So with the beard, I'm gonna take off just the tiniest, tiniest, tiniest bit of length. We'll leave with most of it. Just to get rid of those little stray hairs that everyone gets. I'm just going to brush it out real quick. That's cool. 
This is just water with like a real mild disinfectant in it. Which helps with kind of like getting rid of shaving rash as well. Because normally it's irritation or like some slight bacteria so. Let's just give that a real quick trim. And that's cool, I'm not taking any length at all, I'm just kind of taking off the, the little stray hairs. sometimes when you get out of the shower and you kind of towel dry your beard and there's hairs all over the place this will kind of make that better for the first week or so and then if you want to put some oil on as well that will help pull any last little bits in place and you'll be good to go this up I think that's looking I'm looking pretty even right now see I've just left the same shape because that worked well my strong jawline which is what we want to achieve right even if we don't have one of the beards pretty good for hiding that so One last little brush through. So I'm just going to towel it off quickly again, nice and gently. It's important to dry it as well because your beard's in a dry state most of the time. It can be slightly different with hair because you can have a hair like a wet look or slick back but beards tend to be in a natural state. So if there's any kind of loose hairs or anything like that, we really need to dry it so we can tell what's going on and how well we've done with the beard cut today. So. a little stray bit still and that's why we dry it Nice. 
Nice. Just give it a little fluff. Like I said, I'm just trying to get it back to that natural state, how it normally is. So you can see just how good you're going to look for the next couple of weeks until you come back and see me again, okay? you done for another couple of weeks thank you so much for coming back again and yeah do you know what I think you are my favorite customer so today it's on the house now you're welcome I appreciate you so much and I'll see you soon thank you